Hey guys, Wolverine here, and welcome back to a new Let's Play. It is Pokemon Trading Card Game. And this is not like other Pokemon games, this one's the actual trading card game. And I apologize if I suck at it because I don't play the children's card game or the trading card game. I play Yu-Gi-Oh! Not the Pokemon trading card game. Wyvern is, cr Wyvern is crazy about Pokemon and Pokemon card collecting. One day, Wyvern heard a rumor. The legendary Pokemon cards. <laughs> the extremely rare and powerful cards held by Pokemon trading cards game's greatest players. The Grand Masters are searching for one to inherit the legend. Dreaming of inheriting the legendary Pokemon cards, Wyvern visits the Pokemon card research. Researcher Dr. Mason. Okay. Off to the Mason Laboratory. The Laboratory. Oh, why the rush, Reverend? What? You want to learn how to play the Pokemon Trader Card Game? So you too finally want to start playing the game? Well, dueling is more fun than just collecting cards. First, you should try playing with the practice deck. Here, I'll give you this deck. And now, you need an opponent. Hey Sam, play with him for a while. Uh... I need an adult, guys. I don't want to play with an adult. No, no. I need an adult that's appropriate for this. Yes, Dr. Mason. Hello, Wyvern. Okay, let's give it a try. Okay, so yeah. Hey, Wyvern, hurry and come here. Okay, okay. First, I'll send the basics of the game. Okay, Wyvern, what do you want to ask about? Nothing. I will explain all of that later. Hold on a minute. Okay, never mind. It's just a fiance. Um, dancing is spending the night at a friend's, so I figured this give me some time to do some recording without disturbing her. The only issue is my dog's a butt. They say that action speaks louder than words, so let's play the game. Since this is your first time, try to just try to learn the basic stops. I'll be coaching you, so follow my advice. If you don't do as I say, we won't be able to proceed. It might be easier if you read the Pokemon Trading Card Game Instruction Booklet while we play. Okay then, let's start your practice game. Yeah, I don't have one of those, so yeah. So it's just a practice, not shuffle the deck. Normally you shuffle the deck, the deck can have, the deck has, the, it has 60 cards. Everyone draws credit every turn and you start the game with seven cards. That's it. And then you choose a basic Pokemon in there and then you place it on the field. And then from there you put others on your bench. So yeah. Now if you do not have basic Pokemon, you stick your hand back in your deck, reshuffle your deck, and then you draw seven more until you get a basic. Yeah, I know. Okay. Yeah, 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 whatever. We place prizes. Normally, it depends on the prizes, depend on the amount of people. By collecting prizes, you have the chance of winning or losing. So, if you get all your prizes, you win. If your opponent gets all their prizes, they win. Alright, we go first. Energy. To use the attack command, we need to attach energy cards to your Pokemon. Choose cards from the menu and select the water energy card. Next, choose your active Pokemon Goldeen and press the A button. Then the water energy card will be attached to Goldeen. <coughs> Finally, attack your opponent by selecting an attack combo command. Choose attack from the menu and select one attack. Now let's play the game. Okay. So, when you play the Pokemon Training Card game, if you notice this, there's a little element part right there. That tells you what kind of energy you need to attack. And you gotta have that specific amount of energy. So if it says, so if there's three water symbols, you need three water energy. It can change over time, but that's just the basics. It, so yes, you actually need energy to attack. And it's, Horn Attack only does ten. Okay. Yeah, okay, much up and a low kick. Fair enough. Um, another water energy. <clears throat> okay, yeah, okay. 
Yeah, no shit. Yeah, when you see the star, it means it could be any energy. So it doesn't exactly have to be the exact same element of your Pokemon. First things first, we'll stick the Psychic on there. By the way, guys, I want to show you something very important. So, if, okay, so let's say Goldeen was knocked out and I didn't have Star U. Because I had no more Pokemon, I would lose. So if we can knock, knock out the Machop this turn, we will win. But of course, for some reason, because this is like the whole freaking hardest thing in the fucking world. But that's how it goes. Another way, the only other way to win against your opponent is if they try to um, draw and they have no cards in their deck. So you can't deck out your opponent. But those are the only ways to beat the opponent. Yeah, 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 yeah. Shut up. Shut up. That's nice. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. I don't understand why they have you use um, horn attacks. It doesn't matter what attack you use as long as you knock them out. Okay, so we're going to put a water energy on the star you. Attack. Horn attack. So there's three form of cards in the game. There's trainer cards, energy cards, and you have your um your Pokemon cards, your actual Pokemon. And the Pokemon are separated by two eras. You have um Yeah, okay, water energy, drowsy, and then attack, that's nice. You have fossils, which are counted as trainer cards slash monsters. Basic cards and evolutionary cards. And I'm sorry you heard that, guys. That was my dog Coco burping. Like, what the heck was that, Coco? That's just crazy. And by the way, he's very intent to the game. He's learning the game with you guys. So he's just sitting here watching the screen go by. So, yeah. This game, this battle will always be exactly the same no matter how many times you restart the game because it's the game programming and if you don't follow the dude, he'll may force you to do it all over again and we're not going to do that. Oh, hell no. Yeah, that's nice. We're not going to do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's get ready for Stormy's attack coming in. We use the water energy attack to stir you, and then we can smack the opponent. We'll literally slap. We're gonna slap that bitch. Give it a bitch slap. Just go. Whoosh. My dog's looking at me like, how dare you? How dare you, huh, bud? How dare you? <laughs> no, don't be putting your face on the screen. You are being fine until now, and then you're gonna start doing that shit. No. Be good. Okay. Now what? Oh, seeking, because that's fucking useful as hell. Yeah, okay. I also touch water energy to start you. Please, guys, remember. Um, I'm definitely not going to be remembering to. I'm definitely not going to forget to attack. By God, I hope I don't forget to attack. I could lose you a game. Which I actually was doing today in Yu-Gi-Oh! I totally forgot to attack and we lost. As an attack duel. Because I forgot to attack, I lost. And I was like, I'm such an idiot. Coco's like, yeah. My dog Coco's like, yep, yeah, you were an idiot. Oh, thank you. And it's actually very cold. Like, dang. In my room, it's like very cold. Normally, it's like very hot. Yeah, if its head were paralyzed. I think even the um the coin flips are even like programmed. 
in the, in this first duel. So it's not like, you know, well, you never know what's going to happen. Yeah, you do if you played it long enough or as many times. Okay, so yeah, let's just finish the battle. Just attack. Okay, and then we just pick up the last prize. Okay. Uh, we could stick a water energy on Drowsy, because why not? And we'll just use Star Freeze. Now, paralysis, how it works, it's not like the regular RPG paralysis. What happens is, is that it's cured of paralysis in between turns. So, after I attack it, it'll be paralyzed for his turn. And then, the turn before it goes back to my turn, then they would be healed. So, yeah, that's how that works. Well, fuck Sam. Yeah, I don't know what kind of style of play I'll go. I'll just probably play like a whatever style because I don't know. I don't play this game. I know the rules of it. I just don't know the strategies. Hmm, let me add some of my own cards to yours. Now, Wyvern, what kind of deck do you want? Charmander. I always go Charmander, guys. You guys are probably thinking, why the fuck Charmander? I love Charmander. He was my favorite. Okay, a Charmander in front decks. Here are the remaining cards. Thank you. I received 30 cards. You should deal with many other people. Why don't you get to go one of the card clubs? There are many people playing at the clubs. Collect new cards and try to build a new deck. Okay. No. No, I don't care what they have to say. No, no, okay, that's nice. That's sweet of you. Now, first things first, let's check our deck. Okay, so basically this deck is a fire electric fighting. That sounds cool, but I don't like that. It's got a few basics in there. What we're going to do... It's first things off first. Meowth is useless. Okay. Yeah, we got that Zapdos in there too. That's awesome. Um. Really? Like. Really? Okay, so I guess we're going to stick with Meowth for a while. Okay, yeah, cancel. Okay, so let's go to our first club. I like doing the harder clubs first. Because then if I get frustrated, I'll just go to another club. That's how I feel. Um, Let's go rock club first. Because the rock club does give a little bit of a hard challenge. Well, getting the rock metal wasn't that hard. If I keep this up, I should be able to get the legendary Pokemon cards. What? It's you, Wyvern. What are you doing? Huh? That's a deck? Are you trying to get the legendary Pokemon cards? I'm gonna try. What? I can't believe it. You? The legendary Pokemon cards? <laughs> Don't make me laugh. Alright, listen up. I'll teach you what it's about. To inherit the legendary Pokemon cards, you must defeat the eight club masters and get the eight medals. Then, you have to go to the Pokemon Dome and defeat all four of the grandmasters there. There's no way you can do it. You might as well just give up and go home, because the legendary Pokemon cards are going to be mine. I already won the first medal. See you later, Wyvern. <laughs> oh, he's a dick. I don't like rivals that are dicks. They're just jerks. Let's battle you. Hi, I'm Matthew, a member of the Rock Club. I just finished a duel. I won, of course. The legendary cards will belong to me. How about it? Would you like to duel me? Would you like to duel Matthew? Hell yeah. Okay, same as last time. I didn't endure you last time. We'll play at four prizes. Is that alright? Okay then, let's begin. Yeah, so everyone shuffles each other's decks and we draw seven cards for them. Okay, that's better. Sorry if I speed that up, I ain't having that go on forever. Um, we'll pick Growlithe. And we'll put my chop. We're gonna place the prizes. Okie dokie. And a coin toss. Okay. So it's always the same. If it's heads, you go first. You don't get to choose. 
I think it's because this game didn't have enough programming for that. Alright. Oh, that's badass. We got Zapdos already. Alright. And we can't do nothing, so we're done for the turn. Bill, he gets to draw two cards. Basically, your Pokemon version of Pot of Greed. Because, why not? Yeah. Man, we'll keep that in my hand for later. Now we're going to use Flare. Okay. Um. Well, yeah, back to Gia, dude. Okay. And evolving to Graveler. That's just lovely. Um, again, I'm not really smart when it comes to the game guy. Guys, um, I'm gonna try. Okay. Um. Yeah, Snorlax can't do nothing. Okay, fighting energy. Let's take a fighting now. Um, let's play Ponyta. And we'll stick the fighting energy on Machop. And then we'll attack with Flare. Okay. Quit pushing the computer, Coco. Quit being a butt. You can chew on your butt over there. I swear. Alright, let's stick Ponyta with some energy so she can attack at a later time. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to place Geodude on the bench. Uh, Defender. That's nice. Okay. Um... Now let's check the play area. Let's check Ponyta. Smash Kick Flame Tail. Okay. So let's stick a Lightning Energy on Zapdos. And let's just go for a Flare. Meh, he wasn't going to receive damage this turn, but I figured we would attack for why not. And now GD evolves into Graveler, so now we got to deal with two Gravelers. Because that's not the most annoying thing ever. Um, check. Cat Punch, that's not bad. There we go. There you go. Snorlax took 20 damage. Um, really? I want that price. Oh, a Magmar. Now I feel bad placing all that energy on the field. Damn it! Okay, so what does Graveler do? Rock throw. I think you'll do 80 damage because... No, 40. Okay. I thought I would take more because of weakness. I'm still learning weaknesses and everything, guys. So, if I seem like a scrub, I'm sorry. Flare for 20 damage. Cubone and a rock throw. Whoop, damn. Okay. Um. Let's put my chop in there. Why not? Ah, fire energy. Right on Ponyta. Now we'll just use low kick. Another Cubone. And a Defender. Well, frig me. Um. Lovely. Okay. Um. Let's just stick another Lightning Energy on Zapdos and just end our turn. Because we're not going to be able to do any damage. 
Why do you always bite? You don't have fleas. I swear, my dog. Alright. Okay. After this duel, we'll probably cut it short, guys, because it looks like we're recording on 20 minutes. Oof, I didn't realize how far we were going. So, we're just going to use a smash kick. The first door, I pro the first, the first one's always going to be this slow, guys. I promise not all of them are going to be this slow. A Pokeball. Of course, you was successful. I swear. Okay, enrage. Hmm. There. Zapdos is just about ready for battle. Um. Uh, I think we're going to be done. I really don't want to hit him. Because he's only going to take 10 damage each time. Anyways. There we go. I will probably wait to attack. Um, Cubone. Until like I'm at the last point of death. Because that means I'm going to die just anyways. So... Um... Oh, my choke. Oh, no Pokemon capable of evolving. Oh, damn. Okay, dig mud slap. Uh, okay, so he's gonna die. Uh, um, Ponyta's gonna die either way, so we're just gonna use Flame Tail. Okay. Come on. Yeah, no damage. Nice. I was lucky on that one. Okay. Oh, well, that's nice. Said no one ever. We'll use another flame tail. Okay. Draw a prize gladly. All right. Okay, and then rage. Okay, fair enough. Um, erg. Um, yeah, Zapdos. Please tell me I have enough energy. Yes, I do. That's all I need. Oh, tails. Okay. Ah, oh, due to weakness. Ah, oh, it's stupid. Oh, it's stupid. I hate that. Well, I think that'll be it for this episode, guys. The next episode, we're going to get revenge on this jerk. Says the Wyvern signing out. Later, guys.